Welcome to this topic of the Demystifying IPv6 course on ICMP v6 overview. This topic is one of many topics of the Demystifying IPv6 course. ICMP v6 Internet Control Message Protocol for IP version 6 is covered in RFC 4443. It's an updated version of the Internet Control Message Protocol for IPv6. It reports on delivery or forwarding errors and provides a simple echo message service for troubleshooting, in other words, ping. It also provides a framework for a number of other control plane protocols for IPv6, including multicast listener discovery, neighbor discovery, IPv6 mobility applications, and a range of future applications as well. It is the control plane for IP version 6. The ICMP v6 header is depicted here. It's got a similar structure as was with ICMP for version 4. It has a type field, which is one byte, a code field, which is one byte, and a checksum, which is two bytes, followed by the message body. A big difference is, is it uses a next header value of 58, whereas ICMP for v4 used a protocol field of 1. The two main message types for ICMP v6 are error messages and informational messages. So to distinguish the two, you could look at the high order bit of the type field. If it's set to zero, that means it's an error message. Therefore, it means the range, which is a one byte field, is zero to 127. Whereas informational messages have the high order bit of the type field set to one. And so therefore, the range is 128 to 255. Error messages are sent for errors encountered in the forwarding or delivery path by the destination node or an intermediate router. Informational messages provide diagnostic functions and additional host functionality, as mentioned on the previous slide. ICMP v6 error messages have four main types. Type 1, destination unreachable messages, as you can see, depending on the code messages, depends on what, what type of destination and reachable message it is, such as code 0 for no route to destination. Type 2 is a packet too big message, meaning the packet exceeded the MTU of the outgoing link. Type 3 is a time exceeded message, meaning either the hop limit was exceeded or the fragment reassembly time was exceeded. Type 4 is a parameter problem message. ICMP v6 informational messages take various forms. They could be request or solicitation type messages, reply or advertisement type messages. They will contain an identifier and a sequence number to distinguish them. And as I mentioned on a previous slide, the ping function, echo request and echo reply, have specific type values of 128 and 129 respectively. ICMP v6 provides a control plane framework for a variety of different types of functions. Specifically for neighbor discovery, there are router solicitation, router advertisement, neighbor solicitation, neighbor advertisement messages, and you can see on this slide the various type values that depict that. So a router solicitation gives a host the capability to request routers to send router advertisements immediately. Otherwise, router solicitations are sent unsolicited by routers periodically. There will be more discussed about neighbor discovery in a separate topic of this demystifying IPv6 course. So as you can see on this slide, I mentioned earlier that the type and code values are different for ICMP v4 as opposed to ICMP v6. So you have similar types of messages such as destination unreachable, but with ICMP v4 the network unreachable message is type 3 code 0, 
whereas with IPv6, it's referred to as no route to destination and has type 1 code 0. The intention is not for you to memorize all these different type and code values. You can certainly look that up in RFC 4443, but just to give you an idea of some of the similarities and differences in the equivalent message types between ICMPv4 and ICMPv6. Finally, ICMPv6 provides a framework for another type of common protocol, MLD, or Multicast Listener Discovery Protocol. Similar to IGMP for IPv4, Internet Group Message Protocol, it is a way for clients to express their interest in receiving multicast traffic, and it uses ICMPv6 message types 131. There are two versions of MLD, MLD version 1, as described in RFC 2710, and MLD version 2, which is described in RFC 3810. Those are functionally equivalent to IGMP version 2 and IGMP version 3, respectively, for IPv4. So, MLV, so MLD version 2, or ICMP version 3 for IPv4, supports source-specific requests. Another thing of note is when a node first boots up, it will actually send an MLD packet type 131 using its SNM address to register with the Layer 3 infrastructure. Thank you for taking the time for viewing this topic on the Demystifying IPv6 course on the ICMPv6 Protocol Overview.